Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you are new. I'm Rashandria of Rose Budget Life. And today I have a second paycheck of the month of March. Paycheck budget. If you like the content that I upload, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's get into today's paycheck budget. This is my second and final paycheck for the month of March. And that is $1,056. So that's what I'll be budgeting for today. And this is income from my nine to five. I am my office coordinator. I did work about 83 hours last week. Well, to combine the two weeks, I did work about 83 hours. I work currently with seven providers. So that's just a little backstory. But our income is $1,500. I'm sorry, $1,056. And this is from my nine to five. Starting off first is tithing. Gets 106. And that is 10% of my income. Up next is my cell phone bill with AT&T. That is 100. Next is my um, Gastro One bill, paying $25 towards that. My last credit card, which is Bike of America, I pay $128 towards that. MLGW, which is my light gas and water bill, $200. My windows on my current home. That I own is 232. My identity IQ is 30. And then I'm gonna put this down here. Last thing I did was my med, my medication for the month that was $30. So let's tally it up and see where we are. Starting off with type, that's 106. AT&T is 100. 25 for gastro, 128 for my last credit card, 200 for MLGW, 232 for my windows, 30 for identity IQ, 30 for my medicine, and that is 851. And if I take 1056 minus 851 gives me 205 remaining. From there, I'm going to do gas. Gas is going to get 145. And then it should be 58 remaining. So let's see. 205 minus 145. That's 60 remaining. Not 58. From up here, I am going to do buffer. Send this to my buffer checking account. That is $2. From there, we have 58 remaining and next I'm going to do an extra debt payment and that is going to get the 58 remaining and that should give us a zero base budget and let's just make sure make sure double check that income 1056 Bills, 851, 145 for cash envelopes, $2 for sinking fund, nothing for saving challenges, and then I did 58 towards extra debt. And let's make sure this equals zero. Starting off right here, income was 1000 uh, 56 
minus 851 for bills, minus 140, 45 for cash envelopes, $2 for buffer, and 58 for debt. There we have it. That give us a zero base budget. And I hope you enjoyed my budget breakdown for my second paycheck of March. And right before I let you go, I do want to read a card from the Box of Blessings. Today I have humble yourselves before the Lord and he will lift you up. You can find that in James 4 and 10. This one. The name of the Lord is a strong fortress. The godly run to him and the godly run to him and are saved. You can find that in Proverbs 18 and 10. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Like, share, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next one. Take care.